Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. My name is Chillerx and today I'm going to show you how to make a um a semi-automatic wheat farm. So you're gonna need grass block, dispensers, redstone repeater. To make it stackable, you're gonna need a redstone torch, redstone, water bucket, any type of building block. And yeah, that's what we're gonna need for now. So First thing you want to do is make an 8x8, so there's a 3, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, so that's 8 by um, 8 by one so 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, just like that. Okay, so now that you got your 8x8 done, next thing you're gonna do is make a make a line of uh, dispensers like this. So and put a water water bucket in each of it. So let's go this way. Four, one, two, three, four. So that's um eight dispensers with eight water buckets. Next thing you're gonna do is uh, place a building block like this. And then do it like this. If I'm going too fast, you can just go back if you want. So from here, you're gonna place a water bucket to make everything here, um, you know, soak. And do the same thing on the other side. Water bucket. I, um, I recommend putting. Uh, I, re I recommend putting slab right here since you're gonna want to have an entrance. Let's get a door. Yeah, there you go. Oak door. Put it backwards. And then, yeah, cover it up so when you press the button and all the dispensers, like, dispense the water, it doesn't go towards the wall right here. And like that, you have your uh, area done. You cover this up like that. Because why the hell not? Cover it up. If you want to make it like quite longer, you're actually either gonna need blue ice, like any type of ice, just to make the thing slide. You can make a hopper line, but that would be really expensive. Or you can make it like go down on each one. So let's pretend like let's pretend. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It has to be seven block. You're gonna dig down and then. And you do the rest. Okay. That was just the heads up. You fill the rest. Uh, you fill the rest. Okay, so you're basically gonna cover up the, this part because this where the things are gonna be. Put water right there. So when it pushes the items, it goes towards the water stream right here. And then even though this isn't rec uh, this isn't mandatory, I do recommend adding glass right here. So you can actually, you know what? Let's make this mandatory. So you can actually see when it's uh when it's fully grown. Yeah, oh, I made a mistake. Hold on. Just like that. And then now for the redstone, we're gonna we're not gonna add the hopper chest for now. You're gonna need a button. Forgot to mention that, sorry. Stone button. Any type of button works. I recommend stone button because you know. It's faster to recover. Place it right there. Place it on this block right here. Redstone line up to um up to up to the sixth part. Put our redstone repeater. A block. Redstone torch right there. And then a redstone line. Redstone line like like that. You don't want to put it, uh, you don't want to put the redstone, like, um, oops, that was a mistake. You, you don't want to put the redstone on top of it, because you're gonna actually want to cover this up. So, when you harvest it, it doesn't go flying all over the place. So, technically, this this is actually a lossless design, so when you do it, it doesn't actually lose any of the blocks from getting stuck on top of the things. So, next thing you're gonna do is... Um, pull, um, put another block right here, and then 
basically cover this part up just like that get a dust get the dust and then put it along the line so explanation for this is when this thing gets uh, when this block gets powered it actually powers like all the block around it so for example let's put a rest of lamp right there and take that let's just say this this is the case right here when it gets powered obviously this is gonna get powered as well so when it gets powered When it gets powered, all the block around it will actually also get powered. So yeah, just just a thought. And, uh, and at this point, you're basically done. All you need is the... What the heck did I not finish it? Turns out I didn't finish it. Wow. Okay, let's, let's try that again. There you go, you're done. All you need to do now is put popper right here. Uh, not chest. Chest. Oops. Just like that. And then put some type of, like, I would put a staircase so it would still look like a full block even though it, it isn't. Staircase like that. And you can still open it. So, yeah, it's pretty sick. Okay, now for the demonstration. Okay, we're gonna need a hoe and some seeds. It can be any seeds that, like, you know, potato, carrot. It can be those type of seeds, but not pumpkin seeds or melon seeds. There's also another design that uses pistons instead of uh, dispensers, but the problem with that is that. The piston only covers 6 blocks instead of 8, so it's really your choice. I'm gonna show you the uh, piston design later. There you go. Cover, cover it all with the beat. I am playing in the creative world, so it grows this fast. Since I have the random tick speed at like 9,000. So, yeah. And yeah, let's see. Let's see. Uh, let's see in action. Look at that, looks nice. All goes down to one hopper. You can place more hoppers, but like I said before, it's really expensive. Now let's just wait for this to do, their, do its thing. Okay, so while that thing is, um, you know, checking all the items now, I'm actually going to show you guys a fail tutorial because, you know, it's failed because it was actually way too long. Look at this. I'm using the same design, but I just stacked it together. Uh, as you can see, this is three, three, then one. This actually is seven block instead of eight. So the water keeps flowing from that water bucket. Uh, it looks like this. It's basically the same design. I just made it much more longer and added more lights because if you're going to extend it like I did, you actually add, have to add more light because in some point, it would make it uh, have a light level of zero, so it wouldn't be possible. Also, wow, that thing is doing its thing. I'm gonna go show you guys how they do the um, how they do the piston one. I, I, well, at least how I think they did it. Okay, so let's just do a two by eight, uh, two for now. So let's make a platform. This uh, this isn't required. I just want to make a platform to make it much more better looking. If you watch PewDiePie's like first Minecraft, not the first one, but like the one from I think 2018, 2019, you're actually gonna see how um, how it would look like. So blocks right there. I think there was definitely some you know water, but water sources right here Bam. cover it up just like that. just like usual then there was a piston right here that was always extended 
so let's do that. No. Wait, no. <laughs> it was always suspended. So. Okay, here's the thing about that farm. Uh, it, it was actually the first redstone I learned. And that was the time before I actually even knew what redstone was actually for. Like I like I knew it I knew it was like it had some uses, but I didn't know it would actually it could actually be used for um good stuff. No, this isn't professional, I'm just showing you guys what can also be like how it can also work if you want it. I have made a mistake, hold on. There you go, perfect. So when you press the button, it would lower and then you would get your farm ruined because you're an idiot. Okay, let's try, uh, let's try it again. Oh yeah, I remember. In, uh, in PewDiePie's uh, Minecraft series, he actually had the um, the things like right here on top. So Okay, yeah, it was right here. So you put a repeater right there. There you go. Then when you click the button, <laughs> I'm really sorry about that. Then when you click the button, it would. Really <laughs> let's try that again, okay? I'm sorry. I was I was really planning to showcase it, but let's do it again. If I remember correctly, he actually used a lever. I haven't watched him okay? in like in so long. Ta da! Yeah, it, it only has six blocks, so I really don't recommend that this one unless you want to save. Um, unless you want to save some water, then I mean some buckets, then go ahead. So this is what we got from that. Just imagine how much loot I got from this. Let's see. Yeah. I need to remind you, 64, 64, 64, okay? That alone was 192 wheat. Plus, plus, uh, so that was 192, plus 336 from these things. So, I'm just saying, this can actually work a lot. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how to make it stackable. Because, you know, I'm feeling, I'm feeling kind of nice today. Okay, so to make it stackable, I actually made a mistake here. It actually, you would have, it actually would have to move this up by one block, which isn't gonna be much of a problem. So, yeah, do that. Redstone right there. Button right here. Another line of redstone on the top right here. Block, redstone board, repeater. And there you go. So that should work as usual. Yeah, it does. Which then you're gonna add, I guess, uh, you're gonna add another block right here. Oops. And then you're gonna add block of iron right there another block of iron on top if you want to make another layer redstone torch right there another line as usual and make something stackable redstone torch right here i mean not redstone torch. redstone dust right here a line of uh dispensers right here and then yeah basically you're just gonna do the same thing all over again Anyways, um, I'm just saying this. If you have schematica and it's a like, if it's allowed on the th on the place you're uh, playing this on, I really recommend you use it. Cause this is actually gonna be really hard to use. Uh, this is actually gonna be really hard to make in uh, in like 
manually repeatedly over and over again you're gonna get bored so i do recommend making some type of schematic and just like last time you're gonna add a door right here Basically done again. Just gonna have to replace this with um oh. Okay everyone, so now we're gonna try Come on bro. Anyways, we're gonna try now, let's see. Oh that is just beautiful. If you're gonna make this much more like, you know, bigger I, this time I actually really recommend you use hoppers. If you have that much iron to, you know, in your disposal, then please use hoppers. Or else, this isn't gonna be a lose list this time, and your items are actually gonna despawn. So yeah, just a recommendation. And then, there you go. Basically done, so... What the heck? <laughs> so this is gonna be the end of my tutorial. Um, I really hope you guys learned something, you know? Cause, yeah, it's pretty interesting. This is one of the first farms I actually learned how to do before they actually log farm stuff. So, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, my name is Childrens. Yes, as I just said before, if you see me in Skyblock, give me items. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, thank you guys for watching and yeah, have a good one. Bye-bye.